Remember, kid, there's heroes and there's legends. Heroes get remembered, but legends never die. Follow your heart, kid. All right. What are we doing today? Getting in the cages. All right. Let's kick some ass. <laughs> Kellen Strong, I'm a uh, redshirt junior, and I'm a center fielder. I'm Andrew Mitchell, uh, senior left-handed pitcher. Yeah. Okay. Could you briefly walk us through a day in your life as a student athlete? Uh, we wake up early, 5 a.m., um, come here, weights from 7 to 6, six to 7, 7.15. And practice right after that, depending. Usually from 9 to 12 or 10 to 12. Depending on the day, and then we go to class after that. Um, that's pretty cool, actually. You play ball like a girl! Um, I kind of wish it was still here, I think. But um, I think that's pretty cool. I'm Jack Collette. Um, I'm a sophomore outfielder. I'm Tyler, I'm Tyler Wright, and I'm a freshman and infielder. Tyler, as a freshman, what do you wish you knew coming in? I wish I knew, like, how hard it was to actually like be at college like, like at a D1 level because I didn't expect it to be this hard. I knew it was going to be hard. Something I knew as a freshman, um, that it's a grind pretty much. Um, it's like our job. I mean, we have to get up early, have the same positive attitude every morning. How does it affect the team that you guys do not have a field? Um, I'd say that it affects us because we never really know uh, what the plan is for each day. We don't just have like our own home that we can go to whenever we want. Um, we have to get permission to get on fields and get extra work in or whatever. It affects us sometimes, some, some ways, I guess with availability of fields around us, but I think it affects us a little bit, but at the end of the day, you just gotta do what you gotta do. And you know, when we play other teams, they don't care if we have a field or not. We're gonna go out there. We're gonna try to outball them and win games. Um, I mean, it, you always want to be better than the guy in front of you, and it just pushes everyone in that position and everyone in the category of the outfield to earn a job. And it's it's really competitive, and it there's no hard feelings at all. I mean, me and Connor have a great relationship. Me and all the other outfielders have a great relationship. It's it's you just it just pushes you to be. A good a, and, and a better player. So um, it's affected me. I think in a positive way. Um, I like this coach a lot. He's a player's coach, just like Kellen said. Um, he understands the game. He knows how college life is. He knows that these are probably some of the four, some of the best four years we're probably going to have playing baseball. And I enjoy it with him. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it is.
shit is pissing me off. Oh, you don't have, can you tell us a joke? No, I don't have a joke, but I just I got, I got, a, I got a joke. Why are frat guys <laughs> I got another one. What is one saggy boob <laughs> Why does Santa Claus have such a big sack? You never heard that? No. You pay attention to weights? Oh. It's all over the doors. Uh, doors. I don't read. You can get like a frat and to mark you for those. Yeah, wait, use what? Like how, like, stuff you learned in class. Like what? <laughs>